Okay, today I'm going to show you how to make a reusable template with Microsoft Word uh, 2000. So first you're going to go up to the Office button and click on New. And even though we're making one, go ahead and click on My Templates. Now in the right hand corner there, you're going to see Create New Document or Create New Template. Obviously we're going to choose Template. So I've made it, I've already typed it in here. Uh, but now I need to start adding in the drop-down menus and stuff. So again, click on the Office button, go all the way to the bottom and select Word Options. In Popular, you're going to see one there It says Show Developers tab in the ribbon. That's what you want to do. So click OK and you'll notice that up there you have Home, Insert, Page Layout, etc. And then Developer. Click on that. Now we can add in fields that we can that we'll just have to fill in. This will help speed up our grading process or whatever form you're making. So I'm going to add a text field here for the student name and then where it says requirement A, I'm going to make a drop down menu for out of five points. Uh, so I'm going to come down here hold on here, just a second, here we go and um, come down here, click this. Now it's going to really push it off but don't worry about it when they drop something in it'll formatting will fill out. So I'm going to click on drop down menu or drop down list. Click that. Now in order to put the, the different numbers in there, I have to click properties, which is right there. Boom. And in this bottom box here, we can we're going to add the numbers. So I'm going to go ahead where it says choose an item. I'm going to just remove that. I'm going to type in five, four, three. So when I'm grading somebody's paper, I can just drop down that menu, pick you know the score they earned. So I think you get the idea here so I'm going to speed up the process a little bit. Okay, now I'm nearly done here. I'm just going to add a text field right here for the points so I can type in the points and for the notes as well. Uh, now I need to protect the document. What this will, so I'm going to click protect document and this is very important. I'm going to click filling in forms and, and then I'm going to hit yes, start protecting. If you want a password, you can put it on there and I click OK. Now I'm going to go to the office button. I want to click save or save as either way uh, where it says word I'm going to click it should say word template if it doesn't go ahead and select that it'll put it inside the templates folder that's already created by Microsoft Office so I'm going to close this and now I'm going to open it up I'm going to hit start my templates and there it is rubric for a class I've got it created and I click OK and there it is. Now I can't click on anything except for my fields. Pretty nifty, huh? Okay, so now that it's all finished here, I'm going to save it. Make sure that I save it as a, a Word document, uh, not a Word template. You might have to change that down there. And you can put it into your, your documents or wherever it is you want to save it. And that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching. Hope it was helpful.